I think it's so important, like cups like the Lioness Cup, you know, that safe space for women to compete. And it's like girls on my team, you know what, playing competitive and stuff, they're faced with so much hatred, so much misogyny, and just it's not a nice place for them. So having somewhere where it's like really safe and really fun and like, you know, you're not going to be met with people being toxic. It's such a fun experience. And like, I know, like, I'm really, really looking forward to it and the girls are, so we're really excited. It's sending more light on women in esports in general and it's giving us a chance to prove ourselves to others and ourselves, or to ourselves, of course as well. Because in general there are not many tournaments specifically for women or uh, MG, they come like once a month or every other and of course game changes. So it's nice uh, that we get more tournaments for us <laughs> and we can play them, yeah, I'm really excited. It's very important to... Well, first of all, for smaller, I think for smaller teams and smaller groups uh, to be able to show themselves and represent the whole esports community in a better way that it's not only limited for professional, professional players. So smaller scenes and smaller tournaments, I think are always great. I personally um, find it important because um, Female tournaments are often like, yeah, you know, nobody looks at it kind of, and when people do, they're just like spreading hate and stuff. So it's just like having more and more information or like more girls playing and getting um, getting attention is a really good step for people not hating on female and being like, your females can be on the same level. So I I really like it. It's very important because um. When you see in like VCT, there's not really much representation. So when the game changers happen, it like it kind of like um, inspired me. Like and it probably a lot of girls when the first game changers or like the first ever, which is probably the Rex GG Huntress Trials. I'm not sure, but um, when it started, like it probably inspired a lot of girls, and that's like what we want to get towards because there's not a lot of uh, pro females in the scene. Like I think there's only like two key and a barely any in the NA and it's just I think with the um, female marginalized gender tournaments it'll like put a step towards that like introduce more females and improve the like disparity between the ratio of men and female. It's just good because you don't really in bigger tournaments you don't really get many chances to represent female at least females and other gender groups that our males don't really get the chance to rep them, represent themselves as much as males do in esports, to be honest. And what tournaments like Lioness just allow us to like um, show off. To involve the females, to like improve and give them like kind of safe space, I think, which is very important at the moment, I think. Yeah. Women, honestly, if you ask any woman that you know in esports it's really hard even just to play online casually um so to do it for like as a profession it's ridiculously hard and the community can be so toxic so having this safe space for us all to be able to play together and form a community that can kind of like support and protect ourselves is just so important I think it's important because it makes us feel safe and it's a good environment to start building your career when you want to make it to the big stages. So I feel it's uh, really good for everyone, especially for the women in the scene, because it has been like male dominated for so long. But thanks to Valorant, it's now growing and growing and hopefully one day someone from the women's scene can dominate in the male scene as well. <laughs>